Amen. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, I pray for this ability. Amen. We uphold them in Jesus' name. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I receive love. Take this is way to I receive love. Take this man to love. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Bless it. Thank you, Lord. God bless you. Thank you. Thank My name is Prophet Victorious Emmanuel Manasseh Mbade of Royal Race Church, the Rainbow Church for All Nations. We come from Rainfontein. Uh, I'm with my lovely wife here, uh, Prophet Sarah, uh, Sharon Pulpero Mbade. We came for one-on-one -on -one after I had an encounter with a man of God in the dream that I must come for him to pray for me. And also we had uh, some personal challenges, ministry challenges, and the Lord directed me to come to Apostle. Amen. Yes, uh, I thank God for bringing me here, uh, for delivering me. I came here because I wanted uh, the, the man of God, Apostle, to, to deliver me because I was facing some personal challenges and then I was so confused. So I wanted the, the, the man of God, Apostle, to speak the word, to give me uh, the direction because I was so confused. And then we came and then um, he talked to us and then he delivered me. Uh, he explained to me everything which which is which was going on in my life, and then yes, um, I thank him and I thank God, and then I really, really, really appreciate for for this opportunity. Amen. We came, and then the Lord has been good. Uh, yeah, my wife was delivered. Apostle, professor, he told us what's happening in our life, that's happening in our home, what's happening in our church, our struggles there for now. And uh, it was exactly accurate. And then uh, we, we appreciate the love and the welcome that we receive from a man of God. Yes. Today, as we saw men of God on one-on-one, -on -one, Apostle J.B. Makananese, he began to prophesy about my wife was happening, about her cry uh, regarding the loss of her mother, that it has preoccupied her mind so much that she think about that and that he, uh, is causing her, her health, which we were seeing some symptoms of that, which was exactly... And then uh, he talked about attacks, and then he encouraged uh, my wife to do prayers, to do fasting. And the things that he talked about is the things that uh, we know as couples, yes. that this is actually thing that have been happening. Then he talked about the ministry, about the ministry um, growing and coming down, growing and coming down, which is one of the challenges that we've been facing. Uh, he does. He talk about things we've been facing, like rejection. Um, then, uh, uh, because of that, uh, we got our deliverance. We also got our our blessing. And then, uh, because I came, being told by God that I must come to Him, I must humble myself under Him. Therefore, now what I came here for on one on one. Uh, he already knew about it. He talked about it. He did understand why God brought me here. A hundred percent. And the prophecy was spot on. The deliverance were perfect. Uh, direction 
uh, it was clear. Then uh, we can simply say me and my wife, uh, 100%. I just want to say to a lot of men, many men and women of God who might be struggling in their ministry and then uh, who might not really be satisfied about their progress spiritually, progress in the ministry, that they must come to cherish. We have a father, we have an apostle, we have a prophet, we have a man of God who is willingly uh, to shepherd the people who are called in their calling to make sure that they also too, they excel and they grow and they expand. I want to invite you, you might be a man of God there, maybe you are alone in the corner, you are spending time much alone like the way I was doing. I'm saying you can come out of Lodiba and you can come and, 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 and humble yourself. Because one of the things that hinder us men of God, because uh, God uses us then there, pride allow us to remain in isolation. Then we can come out of isolation. You can come out of solution, out of isolation. Maybe you're a woman of God. You are, you are stranded, you are frustrated. You face a lot of rejection. And you are looking for a home where you can submit, where you can be accommodated, where you can have a father who can speak directly to you. I want to invite you to come to Charis and meet a man of God. He is going to be able to accommodate you and bless you so that also you too, you can maximize your calling and fulfill your destiny.